Hey YouTube family, I hope you all are doing well. Welcome back to our daily hacking news series. Hit the like and subscribe button to give a shout out to our team. Now let's get right into the video. So first news is related to CISA warning. So in a joint advisory with the Department of Energy, the Cyber Security Infrastructure Security Agency warned US organization today to secure internet connected UPS devices from ongoing cyber attack. The UPS devices are regularly used as emergency power backup solution in a mission critical environment including data center, industrial facilities, server rooms and hospitals. Now next news is related to Russia Ukraine conflict. So hackers are compromising WordPress site to insert a malicious script that uses visitor browser to perform distributed denial of service attack on Ukraine website. So today malware hunter teams discovered a WordPress site compromised to use the script targeting 10 websites with distributed denial of service attack. This web website includes Ukrainian government agencies, think tank, recruitment site for the international legions or defense of Ukraine, financial site and the pro-Ukrainian site. Now next news is related to Microsoft. So researchers at Endpoint Security Form Sentinel one on Monday published detailed information on a couple of critical remote code execution vulnerability discovered in Microsoft Defender for IoT. So designed with continuous network detection and response NDR capabilities, Defender for IoT support various IoT, OT and industrial control system devices and can be deployed both on premises and in the cloud. So this can be tracked as CV2021-42311 and CV2021-42313. The two critical bugs have a CVSS score of 10, which is very big and were addressed by Microsoft with its December 2021 patch Tuesday update. Now the last news is related to Ukraine. So the Ukrainian security agency SSU has announced that since the start of war with Russia, it has discovered the shutdown 5 bot farms with over 1 lakh fake social media account spreading fake news. So the network which operated in Kharkiv, Chesky, Tempopil and Jagarpatiya aimed to discourage Ukrainian citizens to install and instill panic by distributing false information about the Russian invasion and the status of the defenders. So that's all for today. I hope you found this video helpful. If yes, comment down your feedback, subscribe to the YouTube channel. We will be bringing daily hacking news on daily basis. So at last, thanks for watching this video. Have a great day. Jai Hind.